As you can see, it's a total loss. A home destroyed by fire. One lightning strike sparked the flames. Now this family's belongings are just piles of debris. Here's the master bedroom and bath. Chris Torek owns the house in Ocoee. She had just rented it out to a family of three. My understanding is the lightning strike hit right up here. There's some type of white mark in the ceiling that we could tell. Um, and then the roof just collapsed. Now, luckily, the family wasn't home when the fire started. In fact, everything's still pretty much sitting out as they left it. There's still coffee in the coffee pot and snacks still sitting out in the kitchen. Anything that is here, they said, because of the intense heat, they, they can't save. The family is left with almost nothing, but it's what happened after the fire that truly overwhelmed them. My renters had just moved from Nashville. They know no one here, and the beauty is the neighborhood has so come together. While they stay in a hotel, donations are pouring in. People have been dropping off, um, you know, books and things. Even the Ocoee firefighters pitched in. Our firefighters inside were actually going around and collecting their personal uh, pictures and anything that they could grab a hold of. What couldn't be salvaged will hopefully be replaced. Neighbors here are eager to help a family in need. You know, that's the bottom line. We're just trying to get them back to some state of normalcy. In Ocoee, Amanda Crawford, West 2 News.